Wilson warns us the Renaissance Fair is not for the easily insulted. Bring out your dead. It's a simple job from a simpler time brought to a modern day festival. So it's not like the old days though. The old days we used to invite stupid people to the fair and you could tell them to die and they would. Anymore it's like this. Die! See, they won't drop dead for nothing. He goes by the name of Regular Mortise, though he's really Mike Garns from Bellevue, Nebraska, in Des Moines to add a little color and collect bodies at the fourth annual Iowa Renaissance Fair. And he's a bit confused by our modern devices. Everybody look! A man with two heads! Like our photographer's camera. What an interesting wand you've got there. Mm -hmm. Our microphone, which I told him conjured voices. Well, that's frightening. You're a necromancer. And cars. Oh, the dragons! He's just one part of a weekend festival that includes food and crafts, games, and kings. I dub the Sir Nut. You gonna slay a dragon? Yeah. And something called the Mud Show. The show that goes to prove that no good taste is timeless. A good time is often tasteless. <laughs> Got anything dead on you? But Garen's, or Rigor Mortis, is pretty much a show of his own, pestering children. Does your mommy and daddy have life insurance? And insulting everyone. You know, I'm not married to you. You don't have to keep me confused. No exceptions. I mean, he's got two heads. Hmm. And we know which one's got the brain in it, don't we? In Des Moines, Rob Wilson, News Center 13. The fair continues tomorrow and next week, and admission is $7.50 for adults and $3 for kids. At least you can enjoy the weather, I suppose.